Yep, it's gone. In the thumbnail, you're seeing the picture of my bike there. I don't. I sold it yesterday. Bittersweet and sad how that stuff can make you feel. You know, you get attached to things and you shouldn't, but you do. So I've had that bike for about four years, and uh, I feel it. You know, I'm thinking about it right now. That's why I'm making a video because. Uh, the new owner, I became friends with him on Facebook, and he just posts, you know, his new love, and, uh, yeah, it's, I feel it, you know, <laughs> for any of you guys who have, uh, you know, had a car, truck, you know, you've getting in an accident, and it's totaled and gone, or you have something and you sell it, and it's gone, but, you know, it's just something that I had to do, um, another chapter in my life that I had to get over and do so but I'm looking forward to the new one um, I did a little bit of it yesterday like I said if you've seen any other videos pretty much it was just a short that of a new life chapter and I talked in the other videos about what I was gonna do um, a little buddy he got a got him a new uh, dirt bike so uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do about the YouTube channel I'm still gonna throw videos up there cause like I said it's still kind of like a documentary thing of just my life and kids and the things we do so I can watch this in the future and they can watch it but in the meanwhile I'll uh, show you my new my new trade that I got here talk over a little bit and then in the future this is the videos that we'll be going with so uh, yeah I have traded my Jixer for Raptor I'm already starting to do upgrades. Went and threw a rear grab bar on it. Went ahead and paid it. What do you call those? The spindles. I got new nets coming that are ordered. These ones here I painted red. It is a 2020 Raptor 700. It's the base model, so it doesn't have the uh, uh, the better shocks on it. But I'll upgrade the shocks in the future. Because it is a little tippy. I, I, it's not tippy. I mean, I can ride. I know how to ride. But I feel how it's a little top-heavy compared to the quad that I had before, which was a uh, Yamaha YZF450R. So it's a little more tippier to that. But uh, I'm happy. Yeah, I just missed my bike. Again, I just saw a picture of it. So it's kind of sad. But I went ahead and taken off all the emergency, not emergency, the warning label deals. I don't like the way they look on there. I'm not sure what I'm going to do, but I'm going to get some newer hand grips, probably get a newer bar. Uh, the big three, I man, I don't know if I'm going to do the big three. If I am, it's going to be way later on in the future. I'm going to rush for it. The big three is a airbox, a tuner, and a pipe. It's 100% stock right now, low hours. Um, I said I'm falling behind my buddy here, so I'm not doing too fast in the trails you know silver lake i'll ride I'm thinking about painting this red or ordering one I haven't made my mind up on that definitely new handlebars definitely new grips going with the same grips just a little, a little faded this quad made a trip up here to me i'm gonna get a new gas tank it's faded spent a lot of its life outside not being stored indoors so a lot of things faded the nets were bad so i pulled those out gonna like i said i got a new set coming i've watched this seat i armor out it i just can't get the little dirt out so this thing was filthy but it's my new name for it i uh, came up with this peaches because it came from georgia so it's my georgia peach it's georgia peaches I get my peaches from Georgia. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> but yeah, said I like it. It's gonna be our uh, new new chapter here. I'll probably get some new graphics because I can't get that clean. If you're watching this and you're someone else other than my kids, and you know how to get that clean, or you know something to, you know, get this little dirt stuff, you know, off cleaned. I mean. Let me know, because I'd like to clean it up. 
I might end up just getting another seat wrap and putting a seat wrap over it. But so they, I cleaned it the best I could. I can't get it much cleaner. But she was, she was dirty though. She still is dirty in my opinion. But it's got the, oh, the ice, ice blue stuff in it. I'm gonna get already got some LED headlights ordered. I got a lot of stuff ordered for it already. You know, first thing I ordered was the uh, Kate crank saver. I got one of those coming. Already rolled the quad, but I'm going to be the first thing I change. I'm not riding it again until I get the cranks, uh, the crank case saver because those are important to have. Uh, I'll probably get a new shifter. I definitely got to adjust it for my boots. I got to pull it out and spin it up a little bit so I can fit my boot under it. But yeah. It's new. I probably should take a look at the valves. I probably have to adjust those. But yeah, it's my uh, it's my new toy. My new replacement for the rocket. But yeah, I don't know. If you're just passing through and you watch the video, like, subscribe. If you lost something in your sold something you know and you felt it in your chest felt it in your heart and you knew so i didn't feel it so much yesterday because i was excited to get this but after i'm sitting here and get it all done and just scrolled on facebook real quick and uh that was the first picture i seen was my bike and someone else's profile is their baby and man it just man <laughs> it's just it's just a feeling that uh, you don't like you know but yeah i don't know so this is my uh, new toy. I'm really happy with it. Hopefully I get some good content and videos coming up. So I'm going to take my little dude. You're going to see him riding. And uh, yeah. Stay tuned for more. Because there will be more coming. Thank you for your time. And please in the comment, comments. Tell me if you let something go. And how long it took you to get over it.